so half term is over. Download for free on the App Store and Google Play. So half term is over. Just walk the kids to school. Through a combination of play dates, I managed to get enough work done that I needed to get done. And then actually just enjoyed hanging out with the kids. And ridiculously, what I realized was it's okay to take time off. Now that might sound stupid, but in my freelance ahead, I kind of have it that I should always be working. Other than two weeks in the summer holidays, I, I just feel like I should be there doing the work, helping my clients out. And then you realize that actually, it's okay to say to clients, I'm off next week, or I'm off in two weeks, I'm off this week, I've got the day off on Friday, it's our son's birthday. Do you know, like, it's okay to take time off. And the reason it's okay is because they all work in offices surrounded by people taking the week off, taking the day off. It's what people do. <laughs> Maybe in the future I should, you know, plan my work and stuff so that I always have half terms off. I don't know why, but my iMac keeps crashing. Yeah, my iMac just keeps crashing. The ridiculous thing is it's like half terms now out of the way. I came in, I made myself a coffee, I sat down, see it's gone off again. I sat down and I thought, right, let's do this. You know like you do, that kind of like fresh school term kind of feeling. Thank goodness I've got something else I can work on now in the form of my new uh, laptop. Looks like it's got some nice fingerprints. This is not good. It's almost like it wasn't impressed with it being shoved to one side for most of last week. Still love you, buddy. So much for like cracking back on into work. But yeah. It's half 11. It's reinstalled itself and I think the problem is there's a corruption on my video hard drive which is really bad but it is backed up. I have ordered a brand new hard drive to be delivered tomorrow morning so paid extra to get it first thing. So hopefully I will be back in business. It has driven home though something which has been niggling in my mind for a while which is you know do I have enough backups in place. But thankfully there are no ridiculously urgent deadlines that have to be done like today or tomorrow. So yeah, I'm not too, too stressed, but it's not what I need, <laughs> it really isn't what I needed today, but it is what it is. So it's Tuesday and this morning I have been uh, kicking off a big voiceover project which I've got scheduled to do this week. It's a, a long video tutorial, as in like really long. And so I'm, I'm just trying to split it up and just like I did on that other project the other day, split it up into really clear file names that relate to the script so if they ever want it changed in the future it's a lot quicker for me to do. So it takes a little bit of extra time now but would save a lot of time in the future if they ever need it changed. Um, it's interesting seeing the way that different video production companies put together their scripts and helps me adapt the way that I produce scripts. So the good news is, 
my Time Machine backup system seems to have been working. I'm now copying from my backup drive to this new one. I've just been on the phone to Apple support again. They were so helpful, like so helpful. And in fact, I, I eventually got passed to another expert who said, I'm the only person who's gonna deal with this now. I'm here until this time all week. Here's my direct line so that you can come straight. It like gave me his extension. Like how good is that? Whenever I buy a new Mac, I, I pay for the Apple support that comes with it. And at the time it seems quite expensive, but then three years down the line when suddenly you need it and they are all over it, they are so good. When you are your own business and you are your own IT department, having those people to have your back is really, really helpful. One of my favourite things about freelance is that I can decide how every day looks. So I've left that still copying over my files, uh, but in the meantime have recorded this week's podcast with Holly Exley, who makes awesome YouTube videos. Uh, we chat about that. Uh, she's an illustrator. We talk about how she got started and dealing with anxiety and things like that. It's so, so, so lovely. And the first time she's done a podcast and she was wicked. So check that out. By the time you see this, it will be online at beingfreelance.com and where you get your podcasts from. But also check out her videos because she's really 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 good on them. While I've been walking to school I've been having uh, a client to catch up making the most of getting a bit of exercise and having a meeting on the phone at the same time which was really nice as well. So it's Wednesday, um, still not quite got everything back to normal with my hard drives, uh, but I've been cracking on with other editing because I think that has been distracting me. So I've been, yeah, just getting everything else in order. I was feeling a little out of control uh, just because I've been so distracted by that. Uh, but the next few days, um, we've got a guy come to paint our bathroom. I've spoken before on here about how I eventually came to terms with the idea of paying people to decorate for me. I'll link to that video, but seriously, unless you love decorating, get somebody else in and then crack on with what you get paid for and enjoy doing. Um, so anyway, I've just popped out to get him some paint and also to use the bathroom because, yeah, And suddenly, it's Friday. Had a good night out last night with my mates. Was editing on the way there and on the way back. Both the podcast and also, there's been loads of voiceover work this week to, uh, to process. But yeah, other than that, the last couple of days have kind of just been working uh, while the guy was there decorating our bathroom. But he's finished now. Ask the patient to squeeze their buttocks. He's insane. He's awesome. Saturday night, spent the evening finishing off the podcast while my wife watched TV. Seems quite apt, really. Stranger Things and Halloween happening this week. Still no idea really what is wrong with this. Trouble is I don't quite have enough time to get to the bottom of it with Apple because I need to keep going with work. Need to get to the bottom of it though. And also I'm gonna invest in additional backup hard drive and also online backup for it as well. Well there goes another week. We've come out for a Sunday pub lunch and a walk. She wants to go on my shoulders. We've got so far to go. Ah.